in this problem, we're given a change of coordinates, uv equals the function phi of x, y, defined by the first component is 5x minus y, and the second component is x plus y. And we're told that there's a function z equals f of x, y, such that the partial derivative of z with respect to x is y, and the partial derivative of z with respect to y is x. And we want to find the partial derivative of z with respect to u and the partial derivative of z with respect to v of the function f composed with phi inverse of uv. So first we're going to want to find our phi inverse. So given our function phi of x, y, we'll let u The u is equal to 5x minus y, and v is equal to x plus y. We can add these equations together. The y's cancel. We get u plus v is equal to 6x. x is equal to u plus v over 6. Now we can plug into the second equation for x. We get v minus x, which is u plus v over 6, is equal to y. We can simplify this a little bit. We get y is equal to 5v minus u over 6. So our inverse function phi, of, phi inverse of uv is equal to the first component is u plus v over 6. And the second component is 5v minus u over 6. So we see that phi is a bijection. It's continuously, or it's in, infinitely differentiable. So it's a smooth change of coordinates, as stated. So now we want to find the partial derivative of z with respect to u. Partial derivative of z with respect to u is the partial derivative of z with respect to x times the partial derivative of x with respect to u. Plus the partial derivative of z with respect to y times the partial derivative of y with respect to v. So we know we're given the partial derivative of z with respect to x and the partial derivative of z with respect to y. So we can plug those in. And we want to compute the partial derivative of x with respect to u. The partial derivative of x with respect to u is 1 sixth. And the partial derivative of z with respect, or partial derivative of y with respect to, oh, I wrote v, but it should be u on the bottom of this partial derivative, the last one. So we want to calculate the partial derivative of y with respect to u. Partial derivative of y with respect to u is negative one sixth. And we're going to add them together, so we get partial derivative of z with respect to u is y minus x over 6. And now we're going to make some room. So we're just going to replace the u's with v's in this equation. So we know that the partial derivative of z with respect to x is y.
times the partial derivative of x with respect to v, which is 1 sixth. plus the partial derivative of z with respect to y, which is x, times the partial derivative of y with respect to v, which is 5 sixths. So we see that the partial derivative of z with respect to v is y plus 5x over 6. And we want this in terms of u and v. So, but we already know what x and y are in terms of u and v. They're u plus v over 6 and 5v minus u over 6, respectively. So we could just simply insert these terms. And we get the following, which we could simplify a little bit. Which you can even simplify a little bit more, but I'll just leave it as 6v minus 2u over 36. And we can do the same here. We get 5v plus 5v is 10v. Minus u plus 5v is 4u. So we get 10v plus 4u over 36 is our partial derivative of z with respect to v. And then our partial derivative of z with respect to u is 6v minus 2u over 36. I just realized the importance of distributing the minus sign. So here it should be 5v minus v is 4v. And 4v minus 2u over 36. So our solution should actually be for the partial derivative of z with respect to u is 4v minus 2u over 36.